Okay, we'll need a band. I know you got one because I used it on the weekend. But if you're not my mom, you uh, can grab a towel if you don't have a band. Give you a few minutes. Um, as you can see, I have Christmas decorations still up on this side. Clay has removed the rest of them. And I don't know if I can do it yet. I don't know if I'm ready. And this is the kitchen where the new boyfriend will unofficially Let me know if back. you're in the same boat. These are the verbal vacation homes waiting for you to fill with your family. Oh, what are we doing today? We're gonna be together in a full body back day. Lots of leg, lots of lunging. And pigeon, if you want, so you gotta stretch out those hips. Mm -hmm. Start right away here. So really, all all your weights, if you if you got some. Oh, we will need a weight actually. So some sort of object to hold and squat with. You can use a weight or a pillow. Sorry about that. And a band or a towel. What should we get? Alright, so if we're going to start it up here, let's go into just a little calf stretch. So kind of mini down dog. Your legs are straight. And just hold, trying to get your heels down as low as you can to the ground. Hold it, or you can kind of go back and forth. And then slowly get into down dog. Press your head through. Spine's nice and straight. Go high onto your tippy toes. Then press your heels to the ground. Press your chest towards your quads. High to your tippy toes. Heels to ground. Press your chest through. So we're going to that full overhead position. Last time onto your tippy toes. And press your heels down. And on the knees. And let's bring your right foot to the outside of your right hand. Okay, keeping your spine nice and straight, press those hips down to the ground. You can also drop to your knee. All right, then let's bring our right hand up and around, twisting towards our right knee. Pull your shoulder back, twist at your spine. In the chest opener, spine twist always feels good. Other leg, alternate back and forth. You know, probably up there, my face. You can also leave your knee down. squat challenge. Go other leg here. <laughs> so of course we got this week's challenge is max squats in three minutes. So you know we're gonna start off with that. Come out with a killer. All right let's go nice and wide. We're gonna do Cossack squats. So wide stance, toes forward. Get as low as you can into your squat and then alternate back and forth through through that low position of your squat. Fully extend that leg into a side lunge. Back and forth. 
So we're gonna start off with the three minute squat challenge. Getting as many squats as you can in three minutes. I think I did a minute the other day just to see how many. And then it took me about 50 seconds to get 50. And I feel like I was moving fast. So I don't know if I can keep that up for three minutes. But some of the scores are Seth, this crazy guy, got 185. Another girl got 142, I heard. 125, all right, that's a kind of goal. Maybe 100. You do you. All right, let's do a few squats. All right, going below parallel. Fully extending your hips at the top. Big butt squeeze, all right? You just try and have good quality. Okay, good quality reps, hips back, trying to get below parallel, and then like epic butt squeeze. All right, good quality. I know we're going for lots of reps, but again, we wanna target the right muscles, right? All right, here we go. Are we ready? Three minutes of squats. If you struggle or want a little extra even, so it helps with struggle, helps with extra, is to wear a band above your knees, all right? And that will force you to uh, give you a cue to drive your knees out, and then that will also give you a little added tension, so win-win. All right, we ready? Here we go, 10 seconds. Three minutes of squats. Going ham, two, one, and go. Here we go, we're almost a minute in.
165. Okay, I'm happy with that. Whew. Mom, what you got? Let me know. Whew. All right, we're gonna go do some abs because that was tough. Mom's not let me know. Okay, shake those out. Burnage. Nice, 120. Friggin' right. Crowd. All right, 10 seconds. We're gonna start some core. Proud, proud. <clears throat> Oh, my legs are fired. All right, we're gonna do a nice core complex. Give our legs a little break because we're doing some burpees, but still, lots of arms. Okay, feet together, knees out. We're gonna go five reverse sit-ups. Press your spine down to lift up your feet. Shoot those hips up, five reps. Then five, frog, Sit up, so keep those feet together. Knees out, okay, go as far as you can up, or goal, touch the ground. So, it might look like a little more of a crunch, but still try not to round at your spine, okay? Um, then what do I got? Uh, sit up, so we'll go kind of five, six here, sit up, bring your knees together, one, two, Five Russian twist per side. Let's get up. Five burpees. All right, jump back to plank. Burpee. Okay, so we're gonna go every minute in the e bomb. We're gonna do that little complex. Five, 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 five. Okay. See the first time how it goes. Are you able to finish those twenty reps within the minute? Because then you might need to change your reps. All right, so five minutes here of work. Every minute on the minute, we're doing that whole complex. All right, well, let's go in 10 seconds, starting with our reverse frog sit-ups. Three, two, one, well, let's go. Five reverse sit-ups. And five frog sit-ups. Five Russian twists. Good, five burpees, jump or step back. seconds to spare or finish up you might get a little less so if you're running out of time this time I would say do three of each all right or five five and maybe just three burpees two one let's go five reverse sit-ups so change the reps up if that was too much three of each four of each maybe less burpees because those take usually the most time or these sit-ups I think I'm doing these things the wrong way here.
a little faster. Fifteen seconds. My favorite part, just chillaxing, feeling that heart pounding. Oh yeah. And don't lose. You want that core. So always think. Press your back down. Raise your legs. Let's go. Low back should hit the ground. Then those feet should come up. Same with on your sit-ups. Trying not to use that momentum of our arms. Make sure it's fine on your twist. Slight lean back. Jumping back to a nice solid plank or stepping. 15 seconds. All right, we got last round here. Ooh, I'm tired today. All the cookies, mom. Two, one, last round, let's go. That was my mat fart. job. 15 seconds to finish. And then we get a little longer break. Five rounds. Nice. Core's burning. Just watching some great parties happening. Okay, so this one will need uh, maybe your weight, pillow, long band, or a towel, right? This towel's virtually the same idea. It just won't uh, won't stretch, but you can still get that same tension in your spine. I'll even show you uh, what we're doing with the weights first. So breaking it down slowly, we want to go to pick up an object. Okay, back straight, chest up. You're gonna use your legs. Okay, fully get to this extended point. Here, all legs there. Then we're gonna flip the weight over, pause in the squat, stand up. Okay, call the squat clean. So here, legs pop your hips. Oops, fall into your squat, pause, stand it up. Pause, okay, hips, pause. All right, so think like kettlebell swing. We use those legs, hips for momentum, same idea but I'm keeping this object close to me. Again, you can use a weight, same thing. Okay, uh, then we got knee to up, or knee to elbow. Here we can go on our hands or on your elbows. Okay, so trying to get it as close to that knee, or that knee to elbow as you can. One on each side, then jump. Okay, opposite um, wrist there. Jump, other side. Back, knee to elbow, hop, okay, yes. So, we can go on our elbows for the hops, okay? I want you to turn, kick one leg through. Turn, kick one leg through, all right? Start so getting a little obliques there as well, okay? Hey, okay, gotta rest too, don't you worry. Rest it up. All right, then we're gonna go. So you can use weights, you can use the band. Bend over, hinge forward, squeeze your butt and hammies. Okay, you're gonna think about pulling apart, row, pull to your chest, then pull apart, row, pull the band apart, row. So think like pull up, 
Okay, pull up row, band apart. Same idea with the, uh, the towel. You can do the same thing, but yeah, you know it's not gonna go, obviously, stretch. If you got weights, row, fly, row, fly. All right, alternating between the two. Sound good? All right, that's a lot, I know. I just wanna make sure you're understanding the movement. All right, squat cleans with a pause. Are we ready? Say yes, here we go. Lots of legs, think like powerhouse. All right, three, two, one, let's go. Even though I'm not holding much weight, still I almost go into my tippy toes because I'm really trying to use my legs, exert power upwards. Oh shit, I'm not pausing. Pause. See, this is what happens when I talk too much. Hopefully y'all were pausing. 10 seconds. Hips. And good, rest. All right. Knee to elbow, knee to elbow. Skier hop or a kick through. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, and go. Okay, I'll show you on your elbows with the modified version. Kick through. Knee, drive, obliques, twist. Kick through. A few more. And rest. Row plus a pull apart. Ten seconds with weights, with a band, with a towel, so many options. Even to get resistance in the band, I need to pull it closer together. Well, let's go. So again, on your pull apart, on your fly, you're just not gonna go as far. Just focus, squeeze your shoulder blades together, engage lats. Tuck hips, think press, press spine, that low spine out, so no arch. And if you bend your knees a little bit, you get a little glued and hamstring. And rest, beautiful. All right, back to the beginning. Let's see. Ooh, this might be gross. Might regret this here. <sighs> All right, we ready? Pause, squat clean, Stacy. Two, three, one, let's go. Oh, two, three, one. <laughs> three, two, one. Legs when you go to pick it up. So that core's gotta be tight. Hammies have to be lit and then pause in your lowest squat that you got. And rest. Okay, could have been worse. Woo. Need an elbow plus a skier hop or kick through. Five, four, two, three, one, <laughs> two, one, and let's go. Ten 
seconds. <laughs> and rest. Whew. Hey, I'll do a few with the towel to show you. 10 seconds. We got some good dance moves right now. Shaking those hips. Two, one, a row, plus a fly. So if you got a towel, squeezing shoulder blades together, you'll see not a big movement, but I feel my lats working, my shoulders. Pull apart. I mean, as you pull to your chest, think about pulling that towel apart or that band. Keep core engaged. Drive your knees out. We want glutes engaged. And rest. Beautiful. Back to the beginning. One more time. And we got finisher, and then we're done. Five seconds. Last set of pause, squat cleans. Let's go. Legs, legs, legs. Pop those hips. Sit right into your squat and pause. And rest. Woo. All right. Last set. Need an elbow. Coffees. Maybe try the hops out if you haven't yet. Not worrying about how far you go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Bring that foot in front, all right? 
you choose one of those. Here we go. Are we ready? Side plank, hip abduction. Well, let's go. Slide elbow bend for me. My sister. We got those nice hyper extended elbows. Hips up. Ten seconds. Good. Roll over. Three, two, one. Let's go. Slide elbow band, Stacey, Jen. Hips up. Don't forget. Squeezing your obliques. Ten seconds. And rest. Okay. Time. I don't know if I'm just out of shape here or if that was that was tough. That was tough. Just gotta let me know. Oh, I'm just chilling on my back. You do your favorite stretches. Doing a little windshield wiper here. Woo, a little half, half butterfly, always oh, feels good. Good work, proud of your squats, y'all. Hope you killed it. Shouldn't have worn pants. They always make that mistake. Cause it's cold in here and then I get sweaty. Got a single leg. I chew or a little froggy. Butterfly, I guess. Alright. Thanks for coming. Good job, good job. See you